Ladies and gentlemen, tonight's bouts are under the supervision and control of the Missouri Office of Athletics. Tim Lukenhoff, Executive Director. These bouts are promoted by Shamrock Fighting Championships. Rob Doniker is your matchmaker. Your judges working tonight's event are Henry Gary, Brett Miller, and Greg DeVilbis. Your referees are Zach Tiberius and Nick Behrens. Timekeeper is Steve Arsenault and the physician at cage side, Dr. Kenneth Butler. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome out to the cage, a bad actor. And we are back, ladies and gentlemen, here at Shamrock Fighting Championships 355. Jeremy Johnson along with Bobby Volker as we move back into the world of kickboxing. As coming to the cage by way of Azad Kashmir, Pakistan, it is Abad Akhtar. Now, he is still, in, again, in this whole, oh no, guys. We yeah. got guys new coming in. But this guy has just an incredible amount of people just screaming in the crowd for him right now. <laughs> You gotta please them now. Now at only three months training, the 22 year old says, I feel that I am ready. His striking style is what everything is gonna go down to tonight. We're gonna see how that plays out, but he has a tough test in Tyler Collins. And his opponent, Tyler Collins. Coming to the cage by way of Grand View. Missouri, it is Tyler Collins. Now again, looking for that first win in the world here. Stepping in the cage for the first time, started three years ago. The former weightlifter says, I've got more reach and I've got more power. And here we go, Tyler Collins, 22 years old, six foot four, 213.4 pounds. Abad Akhtar, 24 years old, six feet tall, 215.8 pounds. And it's all brought to you by Supplement Superstores. Tyler Collins at six foot four is going to have a huge height and reach advantage. We know though, you never judge a book by its cover here, so. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is brought to you by TGS Technology Group Solutions. This is a 220 pound kickboxing contest. Introducing first, fighting tonight out of the blue corner, a fighter that stands six feet tall and weighed in at 215.8 pounds. He's fighting out of Azad Kashmir, Pakistan. Ladies and gentlemen, a bad. And his opponent out of the red corner. A fighter that stands six feet four inches tall and weighed in at 213.4 pounds. Fighting out of Grandview, Missouri, Tyler Collins. Referee Nick Behrens has the call for this contest. A bad Akhtar in the blue tape. Tyler Collings in the red. Again, Tyler Collings at six foot four will have a definitive height and reach advantage. Quickly into the action. Akhtar doing a great job though there with that lead jab. A bad, he's got some quick hands. Now we're seeing Collings start to chase him down here. Abad is doing a great job, though, of circling away from the power there of Collins. His movement's great, yeah. Nice right hand out of Akhtar. Oh, 
Oh! Oh, big shot. Straight left. Oh, bad is bad. <laughs> <laughs> Had to use that one. Hey, I appreciate that. That was good. Nice hands there out of Oktar. Now, again, He's Collins so has got to stop chasing yep. it. He needs to cut off the cage here. When he finds it, he's landing shots. And Abad's doing good covering up and counter punching, too. Nice shot to the body there by Collins. Akhtar is doing a great job of circling here. And that two found a home through the shell. And with Collins chasing, he can't set anything up with how he's chasing. This has got to be frustrating for Collins. Collins got to got to straighten some stuff out right there. He's got to stop chasing. He's yeah, got he's he's got to go back to the corner. Yeah. So what advice are you going to give him? <laughs> stop chasing. Hit hit your angles. Don't chase after him. Cut it off, like you said already. It could change the whole story. Octar breathing heavy though here in the yeah. corner as I look over. Now, adversely, Tyler Collins didn't even take the stool. Yeah, but he's, he's got more of the muscle, so that might, you would think that would wear on him, but yeah, he's, he's looking fresher, but look how much a bat's been bouncing all over the place, staying away from this big guy. Let's see if Octar can stay fresh. Let's see if Oktar can keep up this pace. Second round of this three round contest. A bad Oktar in the blue, Tyler Collings in the red. Oktar landing getting little, wow. Now Collins Ooh. is starting to find a home for some of those shots. Oktar needs to separate, yep. Just do what you're doing. Oh, big right hand. Nice knees to the body there. Out of Collins again. Smart move to separate by Oktar. Yeah, keep that separation. Only time Oktar gets in trouble is when they, they, they have that new space. I'd say, but Collins does best when he bullies. When yes. he gets him, you know, in that, in that, gets that cage and bullying. Definitely because he's not having to chase him at that point in time. Yeah. When he gets him where he wants him, he's doing damage. Yes. But it's keeping him where he wants him. That's where Oktar is doing well, is he's staying on the outside. Down to 40 seconds remaining here in the second round. Oktar lands first and normally lands last. Good cover up, Oktar, good cover up. College is still doing that chasing a lot. Eight a straight there, eight a couple oh, straights there. Got him on the cage. Good right. Okay, okay, now we've got to talk about this here. So as we see here in our instant replay, again, good shots landed by Collins. He's trying to chase him, he's moving yeah. forward. 
but is Akhtar doing enough with the shots that he's landing and the, the, the fact that he has the cage control to keep him moving? He has so far. Now, Akhtar, when he does stop, he takes a little abuse, but he's, he's getting tired, so I understand that. But he's still moving enough, landing the right shots enough to, I think, win that round as well. Collins has got to stop that chasing. Yeah. It's, it's really not, not helping him, and I understand it's, he doesn't know what else to do right there, but it's just hurting him. Again, no stool are there for Collins. Oktar looks tired coming into this. We're gonna see who's fresher. But again, the technical here is really coming out of the corner of a bad Oktar. Yes. It's what's winning him the fight. His technique. Nice jab yeah. there out of Oktar. And the good knees there out of Collins. Collins trying to, tr trying to tie him up. And that's the best thing Collins is probably be trying to oh, do. Oh, big yeah. shot. A lot of right DNA up. just flew right there. I should have got behind you on that one. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> oh, big Ooh, shot to the good body. body. Big shot there out of Collins. Again, he's got Oktar on the cage. This is where he wants it to be. oktar has got to circle out. There he goes. Collins needs to keep on putting him in this position. Yeah, Collins now just doing, he's doing work. He's bullying. He's keeping him where yeah. he wants him. Nice uppercut there yep. out of Collins. Big knee to the body. Oktar's not able to move like he was before because he's breathing a little heavier. Under a minute remaining here in the bout. Yep, nice check. This again, this is where Collings wants to be. He's making it dirty. Oktar's got to circle out. Good move there. Collings is definitely the fresher fighter here. Using that tie plum, now dropping some bombs. He's got to knock him down at least, at least once. But those knees Big for Collins knee. are good. That, those are working. 10 seconds remaining. Ooh, Collings throwing good the big knees. Big hands landed back by Akhtar. <laughs> What a fight, yeah. ladies and gentlemen. That was a good one. Oktar, you know, Collins, I give him that last round, but Oktar did enough to win the fight. I mean, he got a little tired there then with all that movement, I get it. I would hate to be a judge in this one because it's yeah. gonna play off of, did Collins do enough by, by getting and controlling the position. Did Oktar do enough because of the damage in the shots? We are gonna see how that one plays out, but what a fight. That was a good one, yeah. It's good to see Collins come back in the end, you know? Shows how tough, how bad they do want it. He's just gotta go back to the drawing board and, and figure out what he's gotta do differently. Well, I can't wait to hear it. Let's get our results. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for tonight's official decision, and all three judges at cage side have scored this contest 29-28 in favor of your winner by unanimous decision out of the red corner, Tyler Collins! Interesting decision there. The judge sees Tyler Collins taking two rounds. Abad Akhtar taking one. What a fight here at Shamrock FC 355. But we will be right back right after these messages.